Receiving signals from space could be the most interesting thing you can do as your first radio experiment. Every few months, the astronauts on the International Space Station organize a special activity and start transmitting pictures down to Earth. Almost all the astronauts on the ISS are ham radio operators and if you are a licensed ham and you are listening at the right time, you may hear them calling CQ. Let's see how to receive them and how to decode the pictures. We will be using a program called RxSSTV by Oscar November 6 Mike Uniform. As always, you can find links to all the software used down in the description. Open it and then go to Setup and click on RxSSTV. Here enable Use UTC Time, Include SSTV Mode and FSK ID. Also enable Add Comment to Picture and enter your call sign. You can skip this step if you don't have one. Next go to Sound Control and Devices and make sure that your microphone or audio input from your radio is the default device. Here I have a virtual audio cable because I will use a sample recording to test the program. You can find this sample in the description. This is what decoding SSTV looks like. A complete image takes 2 minutes to decode. After decoding the image, you can find it in the History tab. If you want to access the pictures, they are located in C RxSSTV History. When you open the picture, you will see the program used to decode it, the SSTV mode, date and time it was received, and finally the call sign, if any. Here you can select the different modes this program can decode and play with the DSP settings. Usually the ISS uses PD120 and it can be received on 145.800 MHz. Another very useful app is Heavens Above. It will tell you when the ISS is above your location. Go into the settings page and make sure all the settings match the ones on the screen. In the main list you can see the dates and times when it will be above you. If you tap on a pass, you will see more details about it. The time showed is in your local time and the announcements made by the ISS team on Twitter are in UTC. Make sure not to mix them up or you may lose a pass. Here is all the basic setup for all of this to work. You will need a radio or an SDR, an audio cable that you will use to connect the radio to your PC, or you can use a microphone close to the radio but the quality may vary. And finally, RxSS TV on your PC. Optionally, you can use a Yagi antenna and follow the ISS for the best results. This is what my setup looks like. I have an old VHF Motorola radio and a Windows tablet running RxSS TV with Audacity recording audio in the background just in case the image decoding fails and I need to try again. Here is how it sounds. These are some pictures that I received a few days ago. As I said, having a Yagi antenna and using an audio cable will give you the best results. If you are lucky, sometimes the ISS can be seen like a small dot moving on the sky. Have fun and leave a comment if you ever attempted to receive the ISS. Don't forget to like, subscribe and enable notifications from the bell icon. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments. This is Yankee Oscar 9 Lima India Golf, over and out.